24th Amendment had abolished the poll tax, um, which was originally put in place to prevent African Americans and poor people from voting, although it was more targeted towards African Americans rather than poor people. Um, so the 24th Amendment said that was unconstitutional, it wasn't right to do that, everybody should be able to vote. The 26th Amendment lowered the voting age from 21 to 18 due to the Vietnam War. A lot of protests had come up for the Vietnam War. Many young men did not want to be drafted to go serve in a war they did not agree with. However, they had to do it anyway. Um, but there were 18-year-olds who were getting drafted. They didn't feel they needed to go fight in a war if they couldn't vote. So they, Congress had decided, you know what, you're right. If you're old enough to go serve for your country and fight for your country and die for your country, then you should be able to vote in the country's government. Of course, nowadays people try to use that same argument for lowering the drinking age, although that's not nearly as pressing an issue for Congress as voting. Registered voters in any district where less than 50% of the African American adults were on the voting list. And it also said that they could register voters where it appealed that appeared that local politicians were discriminating against African Americans. So it was really a way because if you guys heard to March Selma um, Bridge, right, they were trying to get their voting rights. So it was preventing things like that, actually letting these people come in and vote or get registered to vote.
Um, and their records are available to the public. So this is another way that makes politicians accountable. Uh, people can go in and see, okay, no, you went over your limits in contributions, or this person didn't follow the rules, they gave you too much as an individual, um, or the company that, or the organization that was giving you money has been known to do some shady under the table deals with some communists in Russia, so we're not gonna vote for you. Thank you. 